It is the night of May the 16th, 1943. In all the skies of Europe at war, one squadron only is flying. Enemy coast ahead. Their task, to breach the great dams of the Ruhr Valley. Tonight, they are 617 Squadron. Tomorrow, the world will know them as... the dam busters in action, boring at treetop height into the heart of the Third Reich. The human drama which preceded this incredible raid reveals the inspiration and obsession of one man with an idea. But surely they must realize if we can burst those dams and flood the Ruhr Valley, they can save the thousands of bombs that they're dropping on the factories there. I can only pass on to you the decisions of the Minister, Mr. Wallace. Of course, it might help if you could get the support of somebody with personal influence. What do you suggest? Why not go and see Sir Edward Hughes? I've seen him twice. Also George Burnett? I've seen him three times. Mm -hmm. When I got back to Weybridge, they sent for me and told me that the people in Whitehall had decided that I was making a nuisance of myself, wasting everybody's time, including my own, and that the whole thing was dropped. What did you do? Well, the only thing I could do, I resigned. Barnes Wallace is the man who refused to admit defeat, who saw his faith rewarded in triumph. <laughs> <laughs> Gibson is leader of this death-defying mission. I found nigger outside. Can I sell him a drink? Yeah, providing you don't give him more than a pint. <laughs> <laughs> and don't drink it too quickly or you'll get hiccups. His exploits this night were to earn him the highest award for valor, the Victoria Cross. Well, the training's over. For obvious reasons, you've had to work without knowing your target or even your weapon. But tonight, you're going to have a chance to hit the enemy harder and more destructively than any small force has ever done before.